Hello everyone, this is Chris Cresenz. I'm in uh, Nicosia, Cyprus. And uh, I'm here with a Armenian Cypriot poet. What is your name? Nora Najarian. All right. How are you? How's everything? Cool. <laughs> All right. So tell us about yourself. Uh, when did you start writing poetry? Okay, I started writing poetry when I was at school, high school. And some of my teachers encouraged me. They said that um, I had talent, so I should, you know, stick to Pursue it. it huh? and, you know, try and write. Now, do you write the poems in Greek or Armenian or English? What normally what in English because uh -huh. my education was mostly in English. Uh -huh. But I have written in Greek too, and some in Armenian. Um, but I'd say mostly English. That's wonderful. So and what, what really influenced you to go into poetry? What was the, the main event that made you go to poetry? I think it was mostly the encouragement I got from people who, were, who read my poems and told me, wow, that's so touching. We were really moved by that and so on. So that made me think, yeah, I'm doing something good with my writing. So I, I stuck to it and... Um, yeah, I'm doing it even now. I'm doing it till now. Very good. Any poets that influence you or you have any high respect for them? Yes, um, international poets yeah. like uh, Gostandinos uh -huh. Kavafis, Yanis Ritsos, uh -huh. Yehuda Amicha, he's an Israeli poet. I love his work. Uh, I love Japanese haiku, um, Sylvia Plath. Uh, it, depends on my mood you know I have a lot of books I right. pick one and start reading and now we went to school in Cyprus in Armenian school right yes okay in, my primary school was in Limassol I went to an Armenian primary school in Limassol uh -huh. but then my secondary education was all in English so okay. I went to an English speaking high school do you have any online presence where your poems are or any website or anything like that or Facebook page? Uh, yes, I have a Facebook page under my name. I also have a uh, blog which I kind of try to maintain but I'm not very good at that. Um, actually, I'm not a very good... Uh, I don't market myself as well as I should. We'll, we'll find you, don't <laughs> but worry. I think my work speaks for itself, so I don't need to do any marketing. That's right, yeah. So, yeah. And then uh, before we close, last question that I ask everybody that I interview, do you want to give any message uh, to the people watching you around the world about anything, about your work, about your life, or anything you want to tell them? Yes. Be yourself no matter what they say. It's like, just be yourself because that comes out in your writing too. If you try to be a fake or you try to imitate people or you try to say things that you don't really mean, people figure it out um, and it doesn't work. So just be yourself. All right. All right. Thank you very much, Nora. Thank you. Appreciate it.